So I thought that the historic coronation was packed with pomp, pageantry, and uh, plenty of history, uh, of course. CNN's Max Foster has the highlights for us. A day of destiny, the patient prince crowned at last, Charles III, King of the United Kingdom and Commonwealth realms. London stood still as well wishes lined the streets, huddled in the rain, to join the celebration of British monarchy. Readers, dignitaries, family members, and celebrities, more than 2,000, gathered in Westminster Abbey for this once-in-a-generation event. Prince Harry entered alongside other royals, including Prince Andrew, Prince Edward, Princess Beatrice, and Princess Eugenie. The Prince and Princess of Wales arrived behind the King and Queen and followed them into the Abbey in what appeared to be a break from the schedule. King and Queen, married in 2005, arrived in Splendor. The couple wore their respective robes of state. Camilla in the robe of state originally made for Queen Elizabeth II. 